Hey, how's it going? My name is Resolution, and welcome back to another episode of the Graveyard Keeper. Uh, so, at the end of the last episode, we tried to do a few things and uh, succeeded tremendously. We've tried doing uh, helping the refugee camp. We've tried uh, automating, sorry, not automating. We've tried smelting a few things. We've upgraded our tools, and we've repaired a whole bunch of things in the basement. Now, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to have a look at building this inn and seeing what it takes to build it in to help dig our little friend the uh, friendly neighborhood um friendly neighborhood farmer let's call him a farmer dig <laughs> um but first of all i'm gonna spend some cash uh i'm gonna go into the inn here the old dead horse have a chat to horadric and see if i can buy a teleport stone uh, which is only two silver. I thought it was 50 silver for some strange reason. A special shout out to Alexandru Sendroni for uh, telling me that uh, this is not just a once use, this is a multiple use thing where I can just teleport between places. Um, it would be really, really useful if I knew how to use this. Let's, let's have a look, right? So I've bought it. I was thinking it was 50 silver, which is why I've never sort of um, used it. Uh, can I use? Oh, look at that. Look at that. That is amazing. Okay, cancel. Can I assign it to my hotbar? No. Short answer is no. I can't. Cannot assign it to my hotbar. Okay. Yep, so I can, I, I can drag my food, but I can't drag this teleport stone, which is fine. Which is fine. It just saves me so much time walking around. Oh my god. This is amazing. I should have bought this ages ago. But, uh, you know, I'm not the smartest cow in the pen, so it took me a while to get here. In the meantime, let's go have a good chat to these two brothers, the uh, very specific brothers who chop down wood and break apart stone, the stonemason and lumber guy. So about tavern building, what do they sell again? Okay, so they sell a whole bunch of things. I have no idea what that is. That looks, that looks like a chisel and they've got a hammer there, but... I don't think I'll be ever be buying stuff from these guys. I do want to level it up in the future, uh, but not today. Welcome to Cory and Brother. Unfortunately, we can't take any more orders this year. The Royal Council hired us to build a barn. And it takes all year to build a barn? Now we could build a barn like that in three hours. But the bureaucracy and our suppliers are lazy turtles. There must be something I can do. Uh, I'm ready to pay you enough so that you can stop working for the... No. Uh, I'll become your supplier and you can build that barn much quicker. Yeah, we've got automated resources for a whole bunch of things. How hard could this be? Uh, after that, I'll pay you to build a new tavern. Hmm, 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 it's a deal. Let me see. We need 12 simple iron parts and 12 wooden planks. I've got to write this down. 12 simple... Uh, 12 simple iron parts and 12 planks. Roger, I can do that. That's easy. But... And of course, 12 nails. Okay, fine. Well, that might take some time. Okay. Well, we're going to leave him for the time being. Um, but 12 simple iron parts, 12 planks. To hang on, the planks. Can't his brother, can't this guy supply him with the planks? I would have thought so. Hello. Who are you? You're welcome, fella. Uh, so he takes all the scrap. That's fine. And it's raining. Trade. Let's have a look see. Um. Okay, so I can buy the planks from him if I really, really want to. And do I need anything? No, I do not need anything there. Ooh, wood repair kit. Now, I can make all this myself. I'm surprised he, he doesn't also have the um, the prompt. The uh, prompt to, uh, to for me to talk to him about building the inn. Uh, but that was 12 nails, 12 simple iron planks, and something else. Um, sorry. I just said simple iron planks, didn't I? <laughs> well, let's go home. Oh my god, that worked beautifully. Ah, it's a time thing. So I can't use it again for a bit, can I? Yep, okay, lovely. You know what? I could work with that. I could definitely work with that. That's not too bad. Uh, let's put away the stuff we've got. Uh, I'm surprised. So I went to make a whole bunch of parts in my spare time, which is why I had 90 plus odd gold. Um, 
because I went to build a whole bunch of nails and supply and parts and went to sell it at the blacksmith hoping to level up the uh, blacksmith to level 2 because what I could see on the level 2 thing and I, I, I can't be sure but I think it's a cauldron which I think it's what we need for the witch um, he wouldn't take my complex iron parts which is a bit of a bummer but we'll see how we go from that point onwards uh, let's first get some nails and some simple iron parts so we've got enough nails and simple iron parts to start with, but we also need the 12 planks. So 12 planks, we need logs. Uh, we've got tons and tons of logs, which is a good thing, thankfully. So we can just use them non-stop. The problem now is energy. So that was the shredded apple. That was a good recipe, honestly. Uh, that the uh, There was a recipe that the refugees gave. So that's good. Let's get a bit of shy to recuperate some of that uh, lost energy. Um, I wonder how the refugees are doing. What were we doing? We were upgrading their kitchen last, I think. Or we were trying to. Uh, and from memory, I could potentially upgrade another tent. Although I don't know what that would do. Ideally, what I want to do is make sure that they have a stable source of food. Before, uh, before we, we provide more people to the, um, to the refugee camp. However, I can't even sustain a, a stable source of food, you know. The carrots are just not producing enough seeds. Which, you know what, is no problem because I've got an sh absolute shit ton of casharoonies. Look at that, 91. Oh, that's right, I got a gold coin from someone, didn't I? That's why I have 91. Of course, it's all coming back to me now. Um, lovely. Anyways, we've got all the parts we need. I don't think the brothers are open just quite yet. Um, so what we'll do is we'll go have a look at our graveyard. Now from memory, we were starting to build some stone stuff, but we haven't automated the stone bit to start making a whole bunch of stone stuff. Uh, we have, however, built a mine uh, mine quarry, quarry mine, marble, marble quarry, that's the word. We would start building a marble quarry. Um, so with the marble quarry, hopefully we, we can start building some marble grave surrounding type things. Uh, inside, we're going to build those comfy, comfy pews. But with all the comfy, comfy pews, we needed, what do we, what do we need? Church bench, soft church bench. We need the, the jointing. So that can, can be coming soon. Now I know the gold jewelry, the trader sells them. So that's going to be a long term plan. And uh, we're going to upgrade the candelabra to level 2. That is easily done. We can easily do that uh, before the next Sunday. But I'm, I'm not sure what I want to do. We've got the shrine. I think that's the shrine down there. Um, and something else. We've got the confessional, which is good. Uh, pity we can't replace these things. Oh, we also got the glass last time we were here. Uh, although I don't know what goes in there just yet. I can't quite see what it says. Like what the pictures are to accurately tell um what to do but i think that will come out in the future like we wouldn't uh, somehow some, some something would prompt us someone or something would prompt us uh on what to do so let's have head to the dead horse yep so that is the closest we can get to to uh reach the builders the two brothers uh, so we're right here. They're just up here. Are, are they out yet? The bee guy isn't even out yet. Oh, that's the next thing I need, don't I? I need more bees. Oh, hello. You're just sitting out here sweeping the floor. All right, let's give the iron parts. Fresh cold metal. Great. Okay, give the wooden planks, which your brother could have made anyways. I right, do the smell of virgin wood. Okay, well, mm, give nails. Let's go. Dozens of perfectly straight nails. It's like magic. You've helped us so much, my dear friend. Wait for me here tomorrow. What? Another full day? Oh no. Uh, really? Is, do I have to wait another full day? This is annoying. Uh, well, it is what it is. Look, it is what it is. He's got a whole bunch of rocks here and stuff that are nice. Uh, that would be nice to mine, I should say. Oh, they do have cows. I was thinking this whole time they didn't have cows, which is why they didn't have meat. Huh. Oh well. Um, now we were looking for the other thing we we're going to do is get some decent fish fillets. So I'm not so sure how to go about with that. 
I think I've got the soups. I've got the soup to start fishing. Now this might this might be a little boring. I'm not sure whether I'm gonna fast forward um, this in the video record the video editing, but ooh, two minutes. I guess I could fish for two minutes. Uh, do I start fishing? Okay. Okay, so either close or far. Let's go far. See what we can catch. Now, we did need some sort of special fish, didn't we? Oh, where's our buff gone? I would have assumed the timer. Wait, what was that? Was that? Uh, oh, crap. I missed it, didn't I? Oh, I've got to focus. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Hey, I've got a gudgeon. What the heck is a gudgeon? I haven't studied it. Okay, so my buff is still active. That 100% gets me a gudgeon. What about these things in the center? That close thing there. All right, let's get go to the close, the nearby fishing spot thing first. I keep forgetting that the prompt is in like Stardew Valley where it gives you a couple of seconds um, before you press the button or whatever. Oh, they, oh, I think I missed that. Okay, let's try again. We've got really concentrate on this. Really, really concentrate. Shh, we're hunting fishies. Oh, there, got it, got it. See, it's such a short time frame. Oh, more gudgeon. Okay, so gudgeon there, gudgeon there. What's in the middle then? Something, in, there's something in the middle. Now, I'm meant to give the guy some good fish fillet parts, I think. Oh, we'll check off this. Ooh. I like how the bar looks appears bigger now. I, that, is that thing? All right. Um, so we need to give the fort commander because I'm th talking about the necklace. So we need to go to the fort commander, give him the thing about the necklace. I think it was four silver starfish fillets. Okay, silver. How the heck am I supposed to get silver starfish fillets? Oh. Okay, so it's still 20% to catch something else there. Silver starfish fillets. There must be a trick to this, to get to gain better fish. There must definitely be, be a trick. Come on, fishy. Nope. Come on. Oh, okay. Getting there. More gudgeon. This isn't, this isn't, this isn't, is it? isn't as exciting. You know what? I'll probably fast forward this part. I'll see you guys in a couple of minutes. Okay, and we're back. So, I've spent the last five, maybe 10 minutes uh, fishing in this pond here. And I've picked up a whole bunch of fish. So I've picked up some gudgeon, picked up some tilapia. I've also went to the beach uh, over to the east over here and did a bit of fishing there as well, which landed me some anchovy and an eel. I don't know what makes the silver starfish fillet, but we're going to try dissect or well clean up some of these fishes and see if any of them turn into a silver starfish fillet. I've also dug, dug up a mound and that gave me some sulfur. Again, no idea what it gives me. But while I'm here, I'm going to see if I can have a quick chat to uh, the guy who runs the fort, I guess, whatever his name was. We'll figure it out in a second. This guy, this guy was with the coat, uh, a gypsy baron. Ooh, is it this guy? Hang on. No, it's a guy at the fort. Isn't this the fort? No, it's not. Aha. Uh -huh. So he's just merely a gypsy baron. So how do I... Uh, what is this place? Oh, this is completely different. This path, path leads to Mountain Fort. No entries permitted. About Coco, I need to talk with Coco. I can't let you in, but you can meet him outside the fort. He goes into the forest every night to the west, not far from here. Nobody needs the mountain fort anymore. We've sat, we all have to make a living somehow. Okay, it's almost night time. And if he goes into the forest, well, I guess we'll just wait for him. He might come out this this uh, this doorway here, or he might come out a different doorway. Uh, nope, definitely that doorway. I don't think that's yeah, that's not a um, not a thing. So we'll we'll wait here for a second and see if he comes out. See, I thought the Gypsy Baron, I thought that guy was the Fortmeister. Huh, how wrong I was. How very wrong I was. Uh, Alright, so let's have a look. 
and see what's in our inventory for the time being. So we want to clean up the, clean up the fishes, which is fine. Uh, we can do that really easily. So hopefully something gives me the silver star fish fillets. Uh, is there anything on the cooking that gives me the fishing bonus? Nothing really gives me the fishing bonus. Huh. I've got 42 faith. I kind of want to get something like this guy. Yeah, extra money from the church. But what I really, really want, what I really, really, really want at this point in time is the bee friend. Because I'm sick and tired of those bees basically just, you know, hurting me every time I go try and collect more bees. Um, also, I also do want the jointing, which requires 200 red. Uh, I mean, look. Jointing would get me the pews, that which would get me the church, which gets, which gets me more faith and more um, more money, I guess. But not at this point in time. I think we just stick to trying to complete some of these, these uh, quests. I really, really, really want to get the cauldron. If if it's actually the um, the cauldron needed for the witch, I think it is. I really want to get it, get that and sort that out because I haven't done any of the, of the quests for the witch ever like not now not in the past not even through my fit my first playthrough I, I don't think i even got that this far through my first playthrough uh she needs a silver star pump pumpkin what i need to, need to give her a pumpkin oh well i thought she needed a cauldron i'm pretty sure i read somewhere that she need, needed a cauldron no, I read that she was out of a cauldron. I need to get, get a pumpkin. Oh. I think I have some pum pum I think I have some pumpkin seeds somewhere. But where is this guy? Is he just in the forest to the west? Like, does he not come out through the front door? Hello? I'm in the forest. Is he walking out? Like, is there some animation of him walking out? Perhaps? I'm not going to cut down the forest. No, 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 no. Because that would be bad. I've told people I'm not going to cut down the forest. Every night, he says. So every night he goes into the forest. What for? Where is he? Oh. If he's not here... No, come on. Don't get stuck on a little bit of... A little bit of wood. Huh. What does this guy have to say? Okay, absolutely nothing. That's exactly what he's got to say. Absolutely nothing. Where is this guy? Come on. I'm pretty sure he said... I'm pretty sure he said every night he will go out into the forest to the west and do things. I can't remember what he, he said that he was going to do, but he was going to do things. Oh, does he mean this forest up? But that's not a forest. That's not a forest at all. And I'm actually quite close to town now. Yeah, this is a quarry guy. Okay. I think he had me on a run. He had me on the run somewhere. Okay, where are we? Yeah. I think he goes out to a forest on the west there instead. That can't be right. Hang on. I've wasted my time waiting. I've absolutely wasted my time waiting there. I wasted my time. I wasted your time. I've wasted everybody's time. No, no, no. Sorry. Let me rephrase that. I have not wasted anyone's time. This guy, the leader of the thinger, thingamajig, has wasted everybody's time. And now everybody's salty. Really? All I wanted to do was have a quick chat to him. Nothing? Okay, well, perhaps there's another prompt somewhere. Perhaps. I don't know. 
Maybe the gypsy guy is the guy I'm supposed to talk to. I just don't know. Alright, doesn't matter. You know what? Let's go back home, back to our home sweet home, and let's fillet some of these, these fish. Now I wonder, I wonder... Yeah, okay, so they don't give me any real quality value by the looks of it. So how do I get... How do I get a bit of fish quality? Yeah, so that's just... It's just white fish fillet. Can I just do one of one of each and see what happens? Yeah, that's just another white fish fillet. Oh, I was kind of hoping that at least one of these... Yeah, I was kind of hoping that at least one of those would give me some, like quality fish fillet. How do... Am I, am I not doing something right to get quality fish fillet? So, the bream gives me quality red fish fillet, or fish fillet, not white fish fillet. So does that mean I've got to find... I've got to find a different type of fish somewhere else? Maybe, perhaps. Um, I wonder whether... I wonder whether this guy... Sorry, I'm just... Now that I have the teleporter, I can teleport anywhere I want to. I am really, really happy. Ooh, good fishing rod. Yes, he will sell me... He will sell me a bit of fishing rods. Oh, yes. Please, I don't actually have to sell you any more fish, do I? I can keep the fish for myself. Hey, okay. So, what what fishing rod? I've got a simple fishing rod. Uh, so, I've got a simple. I can flash out for an excellent. Let's go excellent just because I can. Uh, and lure with a gem. Oh, that's right. I needed maggots. I had a whole video about this. We'll just get. We'll just spend a bit of money there, shall we? And uh, equip, equip that, and sell for my simple fishing rod. Thank you very much. Recuperate some cost. I for completely forgot about using bait. Okay. So what I'm going to do? Let's go back. Home sweet home. Let's put the fish. I can't put the fish in here. No sorry Bob, can't do that. So what we're going to do is we're going to quickly slice up all the fishes we've got. And I'm out of energy. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to get the fishes done. Um, the refugee camp, I think it's going to get done as well. Uh, and we were waiting for something else. We're waiting for... Oh god, now I can't remember. Oh, we're waiting for the next day to come. Which has come and passed, I've just realized. Uh, but we're going to have a chat to building the inn. I've completely messed up my, my timeline now. I was going to do stuff and now I can't do stuff because it's night time. That's alright. Look, we'll spend all our energy making some fish fillets. Because fish fillets are good anyways. Who doesn't like a good fish and chips? You know, on a Tuesday afternoon. Or morning. Just green points! Okay, so I've got another achievement, achievement for getting a whole bunch of green points. Great. Uh, let's make four of these. More green points, more green points. Let's pick them all up. One more to go, that's it. So let's put... I've got 28. Oh god, I've got way, 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 way too many... Too many fishies in here. So let's do that. Let's put away the ball in there. Cool. Alright, we're going to sleep through the night. Uh, it is going to be moon day next day, but it doesn't matter because we don't need to see this astrologer just yet. We do not have acid, which is a problem. I do need pumpkins though. So to help Clotho, the witch, we need pumpkins. Uh, a silver star pumpkin to be exact. And I have a funny feeling... Oops, all my iron's on the ground. I have a funny feeling that to get... To get a silver star pumpkin, I need fertilizer, like a really good fertilizer, which I can't get. It's a catch twenty-two. So, actually, what can I can I teleport? Can I teleport to the swamp? No, I can't. That's ca that's kind of sad. Uh, that is actually really really sad. Can I want to see if there's anything else I can do to help Clotho? I thought I could have sworn. I could have absolutely sworn that she wanted. Um, oh god, now I can't find her. 
Clotho. Oh, there you are, at the bottom. Um, I could have sworn she wanted a cauldron. All right, let's see if any of the, any of the townspeople actually sell pumpkins. That'll be interesting to see if any of them actually sell a silver star pumpkin, because if I can buy one, heck, I'll just use the money. I'm rich, I'm ro absolutely rolling in it. But I doubt, I doubt any of the, um, the, the townsfolk are actually selling any sort of pumpkin. I haven't seen a pumpkin anywhere, and the only person I can think of that would actually sell a pumpkin is the oh, farmer guy, because of course, he's not awake just yet. He, he does have a pumpkin down there by the looks of it, uh, but it's almost daybreak, so I'm going to spend this time to walk up towards the stone guy and see if I can get a pumpkin that way. Can I steal? No, I can't steal. I can't take this. I won't take it just yet. I won't take it just yet. I'm, I'm trying to be nice. I won't steal people's bees and beehives. Okay, hello. Talk about the barn building. Task complete. We, we finished, man. The barn is ready. Now we're just waiting for your 50 silver. What? It's too expensive. Wait a bit. It's gonna. It, God damn it! It's expensive, but we're gonna do it. Cory and brother gets down to work. Go take a nap. Your new establishment will be ready by dawn. We didn't. We didn't even tell him where. We didn't tell him where we wanted this thing. How does he know? Oh God. Okay. Well, this that just that just doesn't doesn't make sense. I would have assumed that we would have at least at least told him where we wanted the inn. But no. Hmm. Hmm. This is very suspicious if you ask me. Is the farmer out yet? I wanna have a chat to him. Where is the farmer? Oh come on, farmer, please. At least the rain has stopped. Where is this farmer? I've never seen a farmer that doesn't wake up before dawn. Uh, can I steal your pumpkin here instead? No, I can't. I can steal the apples. No, I can't steal the apples. Can I steal the gopher, the mole? No, I can't steal the mole. Oh, man. I'm so sorry, guys. This episode seems like a lot of waiting around, and that's the farmer. Okay, farmer. I need a silver star pumpkin, I think it was. Oh god. Why do why do the NPCs move around? Silver Star Pumpkin. Okay, trade. Let's trade for a Silver Star Pumpkin. 33. Yes, let's take it. You know what? We're going to take that and go straight to see the witch. Uh, I don't have to walk there because I can teleport there. Use. Uh, no, I can't teleport there. I'll go. Oh god. I'll go to the quarry. I think that quarry is the Colossus. That is a very ramshackle shack. Um, yeah, so the quarry is pretty much up and running. I think they're just mining. I've got nothing to send across now, so I've got my quarry just sort of waiting there. Um, and I'm just going to leave him waiting there. He's been a good. He's been really good. Bill has been really good. Was it Bob? Oh, Jerry. No, Jerry's a skull. No, but he's been really good at whatever he, he's doing, which is carrying a whole bunch of uh, metal and coal back and forth towards my base. Now, where is this witch? You know what? I've got to thank myself. Thank you, past resolution, because I built the bridge. It was a big investment, but I did it early on, so that I don't have to do it again. Hey, and we're across. Now, I think I also managed to get rid of most of the iron that was sticking up around here. No, there's still one there, but I don't really want to go around in a circle. All right, Clotho. I knew it. I needed to give her a cauldron. I knew it. Oh, I brought you a pumpkin anyways. I told you I wasn't crazy. Great, soup is perfect. Dish, wait until all tea fall out. Oh, wait, hang on, I gotta put an accent. Great, soup is perfect dish. You wait until all your tea fall out. Then you'll know. I can make soup. I can make cabbage soup, pumpkin soup, vegetable soup. Is that all she's gonna give me? Just like... Like... Think... Oh, I can give her health potions. I've got a health potion I can give her. Hmm, looks good. Let's try it. 
Oh, now I remember. I'm Clotho, and I remember where I hit my cauldron. Oh my god, really? Okay, now I'm back. So what do you need from old Clotho? Clotho. I've got some good stuff, you know. Jira, Jira, just in the background. You won't find potions this good anywhere these days. Okay, well, I've got a story by the looks of it. Uh, and she sells, ooh, all manner of alchemistic items. Ooh, yeah. Don't tell me this is the way. Oh, that's where I get the seedlings. And oil and oil. Oh my god, I've been missing out this entire time. I'm such a doofus. I need your help, Clotho. I need help with the merchant. He told me he knew you well. He used to buy love potions from you with his friend, the priest. Oh, I remember. They were so sweet, but they were brothers, as I recall. So how can I help him? He ate some hiccup grass and lost a sense of, sense of taste. He thinks he's cursed. Sounds like a curse laid on him by another witch, so it would be unprofessional of me to help him. In old times, we used to help out in situations like this, but then the whole market collapsed. Now it's forbidden. Only the witch who placed a curse on him can craft a potion to remove it. So there's no cure for him? Sorry, I can't, I can't switch back and forth between the accents. Let me see. I've told you the basics, and no, you're no witcher, so... Witcher? Witcher? That's a different franchise here. There's a fancy word for what you are. Chemist. Alchemist. Right, so you can craft a potion for him, and I'll tell you the recipe. Just put salt and health solution together. Is that it? Salt and health solution? Huh. What's a health solution? How do I get health solution? Health, 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 health solution, the green thing. How do I get a health solution? Health powder? How, how does, alchemy recipe? Alright, let's buy a few things from her. Since I've got the, got the cache of runes at this point in time, tree apples. I've got tree apple seedling, I've got, I'll get a bushberry seedling, because why not? Um... That's for 9 silver. I'm really running out of cash this time. Oh my god. Okay. But we've got an alchemy recipe. Let's use that. Huh? I can create zombie juice. Can I buy more? I need your help. Put salt and health. So, um... How do I make health solutions? Okay, hang on. Let's let's okay, we've got we've got shit now. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. We've got shit. We've got absolute shit ton of shit now. Right? We've we are doing things. Things are happening. Screw all the waiting that happened earlier in this episode. We are getting shit done. Okay, so let's head down into the basement. Uh health solution and salt. I've left the salt upstairs. I've left the salt upstairs, haven't I? Yes, I have. Oh god, okay. We've got some salt here. Let's pick up some salt. And we need health solutions. We're making progress in the quest. I didn't realize I could just give her a health potion and she remembers where her cauldron is. I should have done that from the start. I've had those health potions forever. Oh my lord. Okay. Let's not dwell on the past. Do I have health solution? I've got three health solutions, okay. So I can craft salt and health solution. I've got recipes now. Salt and health solution makes spices. Health powder and blood make zombie juice. Oh, this is good. I can work on alchemy now. Aha! Spices. Now, oh, he's not in town today, is he? No, 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 no. He's on Taurus Day? Ah, uh, not so. But that's alright. We've got we've got salt and health solution. We can make health pet. I, I, I honestly don't know what, what to do with stuff anymore. Um, it might be good to just continue researching a whole bunch of stuff, honestly. Like, realistically, researching a whole bunch of these things would be amazing. It'll tell me what, how, if I research the health solution, will, will it tell me, tell me how to get it? 
Okay, yep. I, I, I've studied the health solution. I will put the health solution back. Crafted a zombie... Crafted a hand, hand mixer. Okay, so the hand mixer is this thing over here. Um, but doesn't tell me... So the goo of health decomposes into the hand mixer. Okay. What's this do? The distillation. Okay, so that's something else altogether. How do I get the goo of health in the first place? I'm so confused. Did I, hang on, did I decompose the fat? Is that what I did? Okay, J join me in this journey to figure out what the heck we, we did. Alright, so... Okay, so the fat gives me slowing solution. Right. So fat gives a slowing solution. Fine. How do I get health powder? Let's research the health powder, shall we? Uh, health powder. I'm just using up all my science, apparently. So I've got health powder now. And it doesn't really tell me... It doesn't really tell... I wish there was like an alchemy book of like... How to... What decomposes into what sort of thing. Is there um There might be a thing which tells me... No? No? Uh, you've developed inner voice that helps you measure ingredients. You produce one extra reagent from any material. No. No, so it's not telling me exactly what I want to know. Okay, that's... That's kind of fine, I guess. Um... Man, I wish I knew that earlier. I could make continue making zombies. Do, hang on, do I need zombies for anything? I think I need another miner? Yeah, I think I, I, I just need another miner, don't I? Hang on, hang on a sec. Can I, can I make a zombie juice here? Make a zombie jamba juice. I've got two bodies in the waiting for me. So it's just zombie juice, isn't it? I think it's just zombie juice. Uh, to start this reaction. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's let's pick up a body. Uh, you're decomposing quite badly. Let's take the good body. And we need ten faith. Okay, so we need ten faith. Do we help? Do we actually have ten faith? Because we have ten faith. Let's get another miner in. Uh, let's let's up a production of coal and or iron. Yes, I think that's what we're gonna do. Well, even if we don't have 10 faith, we can get 10 faith. Oh, we can, we, we've got 10 faith. Let's grab that. Lovely. Oh, this changes everything. This changes everything. We can make more zombies. Look, the uh, by the looks of it, we can make a whole bunch of zombies, yes. But it's a very finite... It seems like it's a very finite number of, of zombie jobs you can actually have. Hey, we've got another zombie. Okay. Now the question is, can I use my teleporter stone while I'm holding the zombie? Yes, I can. Oh my god. Okay, that is brilliant. Oh, I love that. Can I drop him in the quarry? No, I cannot drop him in the quarry. That's a kind of sad. That's a kind of sad. Uh, okay. So now we've got two zombies working the mine. Oh, that is absolutely brilliant. That is exactly what the the, the, the doctor ordered. Now I kind of wish we had the zombie quarry going on so we can get marble and stuff. But that is a great start, honestly. Let's use that. Let's go into the city. So we're back in town and let's check out this tavern because it should have been a day. I love this teleporter stone. Thank you, Alexandru. Alexandru Cedroni. Thank you for that comment because without that, I'd look... I'm pretty sure some other people have commented in the past, but um, I sort of took it face value, thinking that oh, I'll get I'll get to it later. I'll get to it later. No worries, you know we'll, we'll do it later. Um, but um, yeah, didn't didn't quite think that it you know it was it was unlimited use or holy crap. I thought it was like charged up like the whetstone. It was only three silver. Why did why did I keep thinking it was fifty? It did not make sense. Uh, regardless, 
regardless, we've made some rather astounding advancements in, in, in the game. And I'm loving it. Like, like, uh, what was it? Maggers, I think it was. But -ba -ba -ba, I'm loving it. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. We've unlocked. Hang on. We've unlocked all three tiers with him. Hang on. Didn't. Hang on. Didn't say. Didn't, didn't he say the building was already done? I did not see. Hang on. It's dawn. The sun's up. Should have been a day. Did he mean a week? Uh. Ooh, squirrel. Hello. No, I don't see the thing. It's it's meant to be here. I see the hole where it should be. Okay, this this is this is not what I was expecting. Well, what's where, what's the quest line say? Talk to Jerry when the tavern's built. Okay, that's fine. Bishop wants nothing. Trade license, necklace, snake, donkey. Uh, captain. Oh, hang on. Isn't that the guy I'm meant to talk to? Oh, am I, am I, oh, am I going stir crazy? <sighs> Build one more tent. Uh, no, not him. Improve the kitchen. No, no, no. No. I must be going crazy. I think I need to wait till all three levels unlock. Somehow that seems, that feels like the right thing to do. Uh, the gypsy, let's go have a chat to the woodcutter. The brother who lives in the woods. That's a big, mighty big tree there. Uh, come on. So I think this is the brother that chops down the wood, or is there another guy? No, there's another guy, which is the actual woodcutter. And lives. he lives up here, I think. Or does he just swap between places, between cutting down wood? Yeah, I think he does. Oh no, 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 this is the brother. Hello, brother. Uh, okay, you're not very talkative either. Oh well, okay, you know what? I'm gonna leave them be for now. I'm gonna go home sweet home because it is Sunday. And every Sunday, you know what happens? We do a little prayer in the church so that we can get money. That's the whole name of the game, is just to get money. We're just here for the money. Hello, priesty. Uh, ooh, I wish I can upgrade upgrade the church though. That would be nice. Communion cookies, okay, casual prayer. No, I don't want any of those. Ooh, wish I kind kind of wish I had the rest of these. Are these just all prayers? Yeah, they are, and incense and a whole bunch of other stuff. Okay, dokey. Uh, can I get season? Building permission. Ooh, I, I can. I can buy. I can upgrade the church. It takes 20 silver though, hang on. I've got 23. Okay, hang on, hang on. Let's let's do the prayer first. We're running low. We are running low on no one's come for a confession. Uh we are running low on coin. Which isn't Well oh, crap. Which isn't what I was looking forward to. I kinda wish we had more coin. Uh let's just breeze through the prayer. We've got the same amount of people. I wish we had more. A whole bunch of faith. We need more faith because we've used a whole bunch of making zombies. Oh, that looks so much better in the, in the light. I wish to give you more faith because you've got the, the thing up there. Great sermon. Hey, everyone's saying great sermon. 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21, 21. Average 21, 22. I love it. Okay. In the meantime, let's put away the prayer. Let's pick that up. 129. Okay, so... It's expensive, but let's get the let's get the building permission. You know what? Let's let's get it. Yeah, okay. Rightful season. Three silver, thirty-five. Okay, right. So let's upgrade the church for us. Oh. I should have done that before the prayer. Modern architecture? No, 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 no. There's far too much light in here for my taste. Uh, modern faithful citizens, they, uh, they'll enjoy it. Mark up my words, in 10 years some of them might even learn how to read. What a crazy time this is, indeed. By the way, I think you should make the donation box bigger. 
And speaking of donations, are you aware that in order to perform ceremony in the big church, you'll need to be a rightful citizen? Not really. Oh damn, but I forgot to mention it. No wonder, I have so many important things on my mind. Just show me your rightful citizen papers and I'll gladly open the big church. You've made me open a church. Okay, rightful citizen. Boy, the rightful citizen. Wait, hang on. Hang on. Oh, that was easy. Can I get a trade license? 50 silver! I need more gold than this. I am running out of gold. Okay, hang on. Let's... I have the rightful citizen papers. Good. It wasn't actually necessary, I suppose. Who would ever know about your citizenship except me? Haha. -ha. That's, that's, that, that's not fair. Think of it as a test. A test of your faith, my son. Do you even know how hard it is to find someone who reaches my high standards? Ah, oh, you don't know, but... I know. Even my brother disappointed me. But that's a story too sad to be told. I need you to build a cathedral here, a really tall one. You and I, we will perform a great ceremony in this cathedral. We will pray for your Vimma River to be filled with water. What's that? The town is dying without water and I shall save the town. Wait, what? What about building cathedral here? Let me guess. I need a lot of... And a lot of hair? What a fine intelligent graveyard keeper you are. Plus one for the team, I was right about you. How many exactly do I need? Let me see, you have 30 plus 10, carry the 3, move the 2, then plus 5. How, what, what math is this? What math is this? 50 inside and 800 outside graveyard score. Oh boy. Oh boy, 800, it sounds like way too much. Let's say 200. Okay, 200 is probably more manageable. What about the town's cathedral? You can't perform the ceremony in the town cathedral? Well, technically we don't have a cathedral. Our old cathedral steeple is collapsed during the Great Blast. We haven't been able to rebuild it. So newly construction is allowed to be taller than the King's Palace. Well, here we can build a cathedral with proper, proper steeple. Okay, well... Look, I never said I didn't like a challenge. Ooh, fix the fence. We can do that. We can absolutely do that. We can fix the fence. But I'm loving, I'm absolutely loving the new, uh, the new church. Hey, hey. This is amazing. I should have done this way, 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 way before starting anything else. Aha. Okay. But that does that mean, hang on, oh, I can't, I've got, I've got no materials to put anything anywhere. But I kind of want to put the wall candelabras now. Because they seem cool. But this this is cool. I've I've never gotten this far. And I'm actually impressed. I like I love the progression. You know what? I love game progressions in general. But this is an amazing game progression. I love it. I love it. And if, if you're watching this, you must like it too. Uh okay, so I need 10 nails, so that's one stack of nails. 10 planks, easy, and six stone. Okay, so six stone I might not have outright. But I can get them from stone just lying about the place. So we can get six stone quite easily. Uh, I just need to record, remember 10 planks and one set of nails. That's easy enough. Um, and we can fix the fence. Hey, we can make the place actually look nice. So let's, let's start mining for some of these and some of these. La -de -dee -da. La -de -dee -dee. We've got some more stone. Okay, so how many is that? We've got perfect six. As if everything was planned out. Perfect six. Oh man, I love it. I love this. I'm excited. I'm excited to have made progression. Um, I've, I'm excited to just have made some sort of, you know, impact in the world so far. So nails and we need, what was it, 10, 10 planks? Thank God we've got an automatic wood farm of some sort. So let's get... 10 which is 12 essentially 12 planks two three and oops not enough there you go 10 10 10 um and we've got 200 red which means oops wrong place uh which means we can also i believe there was a technology technology skill that we wanted that uses up 200 red but that means reducing our blue hmm 
Not sure how, how I feel about that. But, main priority is to fix the fence. Look at that. That looks so much better. Oh. 53 qual- Did that improve our quality? I think it did. I think the fence improved our quality. 53 quality? Hey. Yeah, I think it- Build stone fence. We can upgrade the fence even more. Well. Well, I'm liking this. And I've got a feeling that the stone columb columbarium will give us a whole heap of like really good points. So 200 shouldn't be that. Oh, there you go. 10. Fence gave me 10. So we've got 53. That should hopefully invite more people into the church. Uh, we're going to have a quick nap. Uh, we're going to have a quick nap, but what was the technology that I want? I think it was the joints. Yes, we can get the joints. We need a carpenter's, carpenter's workbench level 2. So let's get the joints. Let's get... That's going to take 20 blue. But that's alright. Look, we'll get the blue. Look, it's... The blue is only for the uh, B, B stuff anyway, so... I'm more interested in getting the carpenter's workbench 2 now. Can I just upgrade the current carpenter's workbench? Because that seems like a thing. Uh, which is this thing here, I think. Actually, can I move the carpenter's workbench? Oh, I can, I can just upgrade. Oh, I've got the stuff. I've got the stuff to upgrade them. Right. I'm going to do that and take a quick nap. Because why not? Um, why? Why not indeed? Talking skull. Ooh, what, what achievement is that? Built the tavern. Horadric wishes you were dead now. Okay. So we've built a tavern, it seems. We've built a tavern. I, I need to go back to town and have a look at that. But let's build... Let's build this second workbench. Hopefully it's... It looks much better. I love it. Absolutely, absolutely love it. We can get steel chisel as well. Whatever that gives us. What's... What's... I do not understand the chisel. Okay, so the chisel must give you, must be used for something else. We can get lenses, which is needed to build the steel chisel and steel steel parts. Okay, but we've got we've got the second workbench and we've got jointing. Ooh, I really, 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 really want to build a pew, a nice soft pew. So I'm just wondering, because I can't remember how much the soft pews cost. So it'll be nice to have at least one soft pew so that hopefully I can get more faith. Look, again, it's a progression game. I would love more faith. More faith means more cash. More cash means... So I need four jointing. Okay. Oh, I can build two of them. Oh, I would have to replace two of these. So I need eight jointings. Okay. That's all right. Eight jointings I can build with because... You know why? We've got an unlimited supply of wood. That's why. Uh huh. Luckily, we don't need nails, but the jointings the jointings do need complex part complex parts which need iron, and I don't think our iron supply is high enough just yet. Um, it's decent. Okay, so let's let's extract maybe two more of these. Yeah, let's do that. Let's use up some of our food to do it, anyways. Uh, and let's just make, yeah, let's make more iron there. So we need four jointings, which, sorry, four jointings for one. I can't do the math now. My brain's shut off, honestly. Uh, let's get, make some simple parts first. Let's make 18 to be exact. And then with the 18, we'll make some complex iron parts. How many do we actually need per thing? One. So... Four, five, six, seven, eight. So I need eight to make two pews. Let's just eat. Let's just eat our way through the work. You know, I wish there was coffee. And I, I kind of wish there was coffee that'll just like help speed up the process as well. Come on, not that far off now. Oh, it's past mid midday. I kind of want to see the the new the new place. Okay, let's put that on hold. Let's go and have a look at the new inn. Uh, oh, I've got... I'm, oh, I'm just full up with everything. Oh, God damn it. Okay, quick. Let's drop a few things off. 
Drop whatever we can. Drop the bees, because we don't need the bees. Where, where, where did I get silver nuggets from? Jeebus. Okay, let's drop the... Uh, I don't... You know what? That's fine. One thing's fine. We'll, we'll carry everything else with us. Uh, let's go straight to the dead horse. Let's not talk to Horadric because he's going to hate us. His place is in shambles, uh, literally, and we just built a shiny new inn not too far from his. We're going to be rivals. We're going to be competitors. I can see a friendly and healthy rivalship coming up here. Ooh, that's a nice little inn. I can see a friendly and healthy rivalship coming up here. Um... Uh, do I... Ooh, you call this a tavern? Holy sod, it's an embarrassment. Where's the music maker? The gossip? The drinks? The, where's the cool bartender? I'm considering various candidates right now and... Okay, you're helpless. I'll manage it instead of you. Your task is to construct a wooden doll of a bartender and set it here. What? Save my questions for later. Jerry, why is there a sword just lying around? Oh, this gets me money. Oh, there's a back air that I can cook with? It's like a home away from home. Ooh, soup. Oh, soup. Oh god, the soups are actually really good. Oh god. Okay. And, oh, it's all in one. Okay. A box rack? Okay, so that's just storage. So I've got more storage, it seems. There's something here. Unhappy face. Okay, there's a ladder here that goes to the outside, I'm guessing. And where is this? <gasps> is this? Is this? It is. Oh my god. We've got another tunnel. Not that we need the tunnel anymore since we, um, you know, have this little teleporting stone thing. Which can we... Talking skull. Huh. But, you know what? That's that's amazing. I, I, I think... This is great. Love it. Can we go and thank the... Um... Can we go thank the guy who built this? Wait, hang on. What happened to our hall? I'm guessing that's what the basement was for, I guess. Uh, but we'll go thank the guy who built this, the stone quarry guy. Hopefully it's not too late. You know what, it probably is. Everyone's sort of going into uh, into their houses and stuff. Um, but, you know what? That means we can sell the meat that we've got. Ooh, he, no, he's still here. Hello. Stop sweeping in front of me. Nope, can't say goodbye. Hello, thanks a lot. Uh, but, he does sell some other stuff. Now, he's now th tier 3. Which is good. Okay, so let's go to... Oh, it's called the Talking Skull. Oh, that's... Oh, that's, 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 that's good. I like that. Oh, I didn't realize it was called the Talking Skull. Aha. Uh -huh. Dig, how do you like your new, uh... How do you like your new inn, Dig? Nope, you dig? You dig? You, do you dig it? No, you don't. Okay, let's head back home. Uh, because what day does the, does the trader come? I want to give him his spice. He comes on doomsday, okay. And I've got the trade license now, I think. Story, didn't I buy a trade license? I thought I did. Did I put it away? Perhaps. Perhaps I did. Let's use that. Let's go sweet home. Did I put away the trade license? Am I, am I daft? Revolutionary message. I could have sworn I had the trade license. Huh. No, because the trade license was like 50 gold, wasn't it? That's that's it. That was it. That was exactly it. Okay, let's get rid of the silver nugget. Uh, just because it's taking up precious, precious room in my inventory. Now, we were building a whole bunch of other stuff. Come on, come in here, little iron boy. Alright, let's put that iron away. We've got complex parts. Let's get some... Barman doll? Barman doll. Oh, that's not too hard. Huh. Barman doll. Barman doll. Barman doll. 
Now it's raining. How am I making the bomb end all without any paint? Let's finish some of these cut to this uh Oh that gave me a lot of blue. And I've got no space. Okay, let's put away the iron. We've left the wooden doll out in the rain. Oh, because we had to pick it up. Okay. Let's use the stone and go back to the talking skull. Uh, can I put... Put... Put the bomb and doll down. Okay. Clumsy work, but good enough. Yorick is your turn. Yorick? Who, who's Yorick again? Yorick, are you sure it's a good idea? More complaints, just think you can work around the clock. He knows all the gossip and... Who's Yorick? I don't remember Yorick. He... And he has 30 years of bartending experience. Before he poisoned himself with an expired cocktail. And most of all, he doesn't claim a salary. Who's the genius here? Hmm, makes sense. Talk to him, I'll be waiting in your lo for you in the local cellar. I greet the new bartender. Oh, it'll be such a pleasure to work with you. No salary, no insurance, no vacations, never. I'm on strike. Have a nice day, goodbye. I guess he's gone, since since you're such a skilled bartender, could you tell me a little about it? Of course, a tavern like this, a tavern is like a defenseless flower, yes. Your duty is to care for it, and nurture it like your own, child, so you must remember this. There's a kitchen and a storage area in the cellar, alcohol is stored on pallets. We sell alcohol off the pallets around the clock, we need to make sure it doesn't run out. Sounds reasonable, customers like to buy alcohol to enjoy themselves, but they like quality taverns, so the higher the tavern quality, the more customers you get, and the more customers, the more money. Oh, I'm already looking forward to the stupors and wild screams, the drunken fights, it'll be marvellous. For starters, put some beer on pallets. We've, we've got to build, we've got to build a tavern now. What's this, what's this, what's this there? Don't know. Cabinet with artifacts? Tavern table? Okay, so tavern table is something we obviously need. Graveyard fest? Reputation? Stop flyer? What? Say what? This, there's just so many things. Okay, let's go down and have a look. Jerry! How are we doing, Jerry? Let's talk, talk about the machine. And now I should break the wall to get the machine free. You read my mind, man. L leave? Okay, so it's not that hard to break the wall. You know, even though we spent a lot of money, just... Holy crap, that's a big machine. There must be a button, push it. What the hell is this? That's a skeleton. Don't pay attention. It's the... It's that inventor keeper. Do you know how to use this device? The old keeper didn't even let me get close. There must be instructions there. I see them. Oh, he loved writing instructions. It works. We only need to put an artifact into this hole. And we'll witness a scene from the far past. An artifact? This is getting complicated. There must be an itemized list of artifacts and instructions. By the way, the wrong order of artifacts could cause an apocalypse. God. And here he included a complete list. The old keeper already hand handled most of the research. It says right there, the first is the statuette of the ancient god. And the machine says, let's look the statuette owner Horadric. What? Take the statuette from Horadric and bring it here. And take the corpse of... Who's the keeper here, me or you? Okay. What is this? What? What? There's just so many things now. I've unlocked so many things. Holy crap. I'm excited. I'm really excited to keep going. Let's... I'm, I'm just... I just really want to get a lot of the base stuff out of the way. And then we'll keep going with this. Like, we haven't even touched... Barely, we barely touched the DLC, which is finding the vampire and the whole Ghostbusters thing. And uh, we've hardly even touched the dungeon. Yeah. We, we've barely even delved further into the dungeon to help, you know, Snake finish his rituals and all that. But this is amazing. Freaking love it. Look at that body. It's so good. It's so good. I, I need to bury the body. I need to bury the body. 
It's so, so... Hang on. There are two brains in here. And all the blood and everything's already gone. Uh... Cake and berry? Yes, please. So confused. So very confused, but so very happy. Okay, we're going to bury you straight here, right next to the entrance. Lovely. We've got a burial certificate for that. Do we have any more stone things? Okay, we're going to quickly... Let's quickly make you a stone thing home. Oh my god, I am, I'm, I'm genuinely so excited that I just can't hide it. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum uh, you know what I mean. This is absolutely insane. Uh, hang on, where do I build the stone stuff? I think I build it here. A uh, piece of stone. Nope. Gravestone. So we need one gravestone and one gravestone fence. That's easy enough. We've got no energy. So let's eat a few bits and bobs. Hey, we like this. We like this a lot. This is good. And building the stone fence thingies mean means I've got no place for to pick up anything else. Okay, well let's put away let's put away the nails. Maybe we don't need the nails on us right now. Right, gravestone fence and gravestone head on the probably the best body we've got with surprisingly two brains. Like I think that weirds me up the most having two brains on that one inventor keeper. No, that, that, that's, that's nuts. Hopefully his body doesn't decay even more while in the grave. I guess. I, I mean, I guess it would, but... Yeah. Hopefully it just doesn't decay anymore. 94%. Yeah, 98%. So they don't really decay anymore once they're in the grave, I guess. Yeah, some of these bodies aren't very good, are they? But, oh well, you know what? We've done a shit ton of things today. We've we've helped Colotho the Witch. We've um, rebuilt the church. Look at it. Look at look at this church and all its glory. Is it, are those two little people that... Is that people? That, those look like skulls. I love the aesthetic of this game, but yeah, that, that's just insane. There's two bells in the tower there. But anyways, we've rebuilt the church. We've made it bigger. We've rebuilt the fence. We've done a bit of fishing. Uh, we bought the new fishing um, rod thing. Amazing work. Uh, we haven't done anything in the refugee camp just yet, but that's all right. Uh, and we've rebuilt the inn. We've, we've set out to rebuild the inn this episode, and we've done that. The inn is going to generate us so much income as long as we can get it up and running. I think that's the, the main, that's going to be the main focus of the next episode. Well, we're going to run the inn and get a lot of money to recuperate uh, every, the, the one gold, essentially one gold that we lost. And hopefully... Uh, hopefully get the trade license for 50 silver. So, oh wait, it's Doomsday. Yes, yeah, so we'll hopefully get the, the trade license for 50 silver. And, um, and yeah, like, honestly speaking, we've done so much. And let's finish it off with talking to the, the trade guy with the cure. I brought this cure for you. Clotho told me it would help. Hmm, let me try it. I'll just sprinkle it on this fried grasshoppers. Mmm, delicious, even tastier than before. Thank you so much. Where do you get this precious ingredient? I made it myself. All it took was some alchemy and a bit of common sense. Interesting, interesting. I see many possibilities here. The flavor could open many gates, even perhaps the palace gates. I need to arrange a dinner for some royal council members, and that's why I need your help. I need you to cook a great dinner for five people. Just make some snacks, a main course, and some dessert. But they should all be of the highest quality. Why me? I'm no good at all this cooking stuff. I can trust no other soul in the town. The stakes are too high. Why don't you cook it yourself? Nonsense. I'm a foodie, not a cook. Don't worry. All you can do this. And that spice you made. It'll make this dinner unforgettable. So, it looks like I need to make... I don't even know how to make that. I don't even know where to begin. But it has unlocked level 5, which I've already got actually now that, now that I think about it. Um, that's amazing. Okay, we've done so much, so much in a sh very short time frame. And look, 
it's been an amazing amazing game so far i'm loving the storyline i'm loving the aesthetic i'm loving the jokes i'm loving the graphics the, the everything's just amazing and the progression the gameplay style is an amazing game if you haven't played this already keep watching me play it and ooh, hello excuse me excuse me i'm just saying saying my my, my outro hello, excuse me excuse me can you stop moving please excuse ah oh, god anyways uh thank you everyone so much for watching that's all the time i've got for today hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next one please don't forget to like and subscribe thanks bye